back to another video. Ah, that was a long one. Today I am going to be doing 25 facts about me, Harry Potter edition. Yes I am. And I'm actually going to be tagging people in this video because I normally forget to tag people in these videos. So I am going to be tagging Haynes, um, Steffi Wyatt, uh, Becca Louise and this girl called Holly. But even if I haven't tagged you, you can do this video too. This is quite a cool video to do. Well, I say cool. I sound so cool. Hip. Yeah. yeah. But anyway, I'm going to get into this because uh, 25 facts might be a long video. Fact number one. My favourite character is Tonks. Can you find any Tonks merchandise anywhere? No, no, no. And to go along with that fact, fact number two, my cat is called Tonk. I'm not going to disturb her now because she's asleep, but I will insert a picture here of her because she's so adorable. I got to watch the first movie in America whilst I was in Disney World in 2001. And I only own two wands. I own Luna's and I own, 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 I own the Elder Wand. I'm not really a wand collector because I don't really like the way that they're displayed. I don't know, I just don't like the way that they're displayed. I just, I just don't like it. The whole point of having a wand is that you use it. I watched the first movie before I read the first book, but after that I'd watched, I'd read the books before I watched the movies, if you understand me there. I can remember reading the first book when we were in school, but because we were in school I didn't really like reading. I just wanted to watch the films. I wasn't really fussed about the reading part of it, so I watched the film before I read the book and then after that. I made sure I read the books first. And my favourite book, by far, and my favourite film, is The Prisoner of Azkaban. I've been to the Harry Potter studios twice. Twice. I'm sorry about my lighting, it keeps changing. I'm really sorry. The sun keeps on going behind clouds and I might get dark, I might get light. I use natural lighting. I'm so sorry. I saw all of the movies in the cinemas when, in the cinemas, <laughs> all in the cinema when they came out. I have never bought a chocolate frog for myself. Now I've had the chocolate frogs from when it was in like 2001 chocolate frogs and I have those cards but I don't have one of the proper official what chocolate frog ones, the newer ones like the that they sell in the Harry Potter studios and in Universal. I have never bought one. After the first movie came out me and one of my friends when we were in junior school we would act out some of the scenes and the one scene that I can always remember us acting out was the flying scene or their first flying lesson scene where they teaching their like getting their brooms to come up and all of that but I always played Ron I've always been a massive lover of Ron I did play Ron and my friend played Harry and we always used to do the uh, scene where they were playing up they're going up and I, the broom would always hit me in the nose and I'd be like shut up Harry <laughs> my username if you didn't know is from Harry Potter and if you do know who the character is, I love you so much. Um, but I did another video and I will leave it up there of what my username is and why I picked it. So go and click that video if you want to know. My username. I wrote fan fiction. Well, I say I wrote fan fiction. My fan fiction is in here. I know exactly what it is. I'm not, I'm not guilty on saying that I have fan fiction for Harry Potter. I think virtually everybody has fan fiction and yes, I am the main person in the fan fiction. The hardest deaths for me were Tonks, Lupin and Fred. They make me cry every time. It took me two days to read the Deathly Hallows. Now I know that doesn't seem like a long, that seems too long of a time but it normally takes me like a month or so to read a book. When the Deathly Hallows came out I remember reading it I took two days to read it, I stayed up until 3am to finish the book because I knew I had college I think it was the next day or school and um, I knew all of my friends would have read the book. I think I read it over a weekend and I knew my friends would have read the book and I didn't want to, them to know the ending and me not know it so I read the book and I finished it 3am in the morning. Everybody's gonna hate me for this fact but I really don't like Dobby. I don't like Dobby. Dobby is one of my least favourite characters from the films. From the books, yes, he's like in the middle. I don't mind Dobby. But in the films... Okay, let me put it into perspective. In the Chamber of Secrets, he is in the scene in the beginning of the Dursleys. He is in the, um, the hospital wing scene. And he's at the end scene with 
um, Harry and Lucius and Dumbledore. Three scenes in the Chamber of Secrets that he is in, right? Deathly Hallows, he is in the scene with Mungdungus and Cre uh, Creature, and then he is in the scene with um, Breaking them out of the Malfoy Manor. Five scenes. Five scenes. And we're so... They, they're trying to make us feel sorry for him with five scenes. Five scenes! He is only in five scenes and you expect people to cry when he dies. Now in the book, when he died, I did shed a tear. I will admit, I did shed a tear. I shed a tear with virtually everybody who died. But I did shed a tear for Dobby. But in the films, I was just like, okay, he's gone. He was in he was in five scenes. On Pottermore, I am a Hufflepuff. Yeah, on the new Pottermore. On the old Pottermore, I was uh, Slytherin. Well, what's the what's the mixture of that? Sl Slitherpuff? I'm a Slitherpuff. Okay, I am not a shipper. So I do not ship Harry and Hermione. Harry or Ron. Harry or Draco. Hermione or Draco. I'm not a shipper. Neville and Luna. Not a shipper. My least favourite character is Umbridge. But what else is new? <laughs> My favourite line from the movies has to be from the second film, even though it's one of my least favourite films, from the second film where Molly Weasley turns to Arthur and just goes, your sons drove your car to Surrey and back last night. And he just turns around and goes, oh, how'd it go? <laughs> my favourite professor is Professor Trelawney. And it's not just because she is played by my queen. Every time I see a Harry Potter pin, I must buy it. I'm like, oh, mine. Oh my, oh my. I have a Deathly Hallows tattoo on my hip. I was going to say a tip on my hip. I don't know why. <laughs> I can remember when the Order of the Phoenix book came out. I didn't read it the first few days that it was out. I, uh, like I said, I take like months to read the books. And um, I don't think it took me that long to read that book. I think maybe it took me like a week or something because it was a thicker book. But it did take me a bit longer. And um, one of my friends finished it over the weekend and he came into school and we were all like who dies at the end because we all knew that somebody died at the end and we were all trying to guess but he never gave it away it was so annoying. <laughs> the last fact this is probably the least interesting fact but my Chamber of Secrets book how can I prove this to you is upside down it is upside down the whole of it is upside down. Fun fact. Okay guys, that is all of my facts. Woohoo! I've really enjoyed like getting these facts together and realizing how much I actually loved Harry Potter when it first came out. Like looking back on it, I had so much stuff. I had the chocolate frogs, I had pencil cases, pencils, rulers, rubbers, notebooks, pins. I had so much stuff when I was younger. And I I never really like clocked on. I never clocked on, but I'm still in love with Harry Potter. Like I said at the beginning of this video, if you want to do this tag, I would be fascinated to see what your guys' facts are about you, about Harry Potter. But anyway, I'm going to leave my little subscription thing here for you to click on because my face, and I'm going to leave another video playlist, Harry Potter playlist, I will leave here for you to click on because I have loads of other Harry Potter videos if you would be interested in watching Harry Potter. Yes. But until next time, guys.